What a way to honor an icon. For an event built to start at 7 a.m., the seat still hadn't been occupied as at 9.30 a.m. The line in state almost became an ethnic affair as only indigents of Edo State were on ground at the venue. These ones are obviously old enough to appreciate the late composer. In a jiffy, the empty seats were taken over by police and sympathizers. After what appeared endless hours of waiting, the body of the late composer was brought into the arena, which looks almost empty, by members of the Nigerian police force. For every mortal shall someday bow to the icy hands of death. That was exactly what Pap Odiose did on June 13, 2013. The atmosphere was filled with solemn music coming from the police band. Emotions flowed freely from the widow and other family members as the preacher read from the Bible. How many of you want to die? If you don't want to die, how do you get there? With the theme, Be Prepared, Elder Amos Akitunji of the Redeemed Christian Church of God called on all present to see death as a necessary end. Ecclesiastes chapter 3, verse 1, the Bible let us know there is time for everything. Time to be born and time to die. Speaking on behalf of the Inspector General of Police, Assistant Inspector General of Police, Maman Safe said the police has lost an icon who was one of the pillars of the police band. The, some assistant inspectors, uh, generals are on course in the center for management development, and so we had to share. The turnout is reasonably impressive. Anthony, son of the disease, played the national anthem, giving it a completely different and classical feel. But has Nigeria been fair to the great composer? I know that from the stories that have already been around for the last few years that, that there were various things that he wasn't acknowledged for. In 1978, based on adverts in national dailies requesting for musical composition for a new national anthem, Paben Odiase sent in his composition and it was adjudged the best by the Supreme Military Council. However, it seems after over 30 years, Nigeria is still struggling to achieve the words of the last stanza of the anthem, one nation bound in freedom, peace and unity. Ivy Kano, TVC News, Lagos. What do you do that for?